Hey guys, Greg Christensen here. You probably didn't recognize me. I haven't had anything up for uh, maybe almost two weeks. Uh, we've been going through and working uh, sheep and goats, vaccinating, castrating. Uh, I've had several videos up of us doing that and thought you were probably getting tired of those by now. And so we've uh, got some of these that we peeled off that we'll probably sell. These are some of these are ewe lambs that didn't breed. Uh, there might be a ewe or two in there. Um, it's not unusual for have some that few that don't breed. These were, like I said, I think most of these were some ewe lambs. And then there's, uh, I think, 33 of those ewes and. I can't remember, 15 or 16 goats here. Um, some of them uh, were younger and just didn't kid. Um, so we'll we'll have these for sale. Um, tell you what, once if somebody, if you're interested or want another price, I probably won't put the price on. YouTube, I don't know how they feel about that. Probably don't want to turn YouTube into a swapping shop. But um, I'll put my email address up in the comments, or you can go to the Grandview Livestock website and get it. Um, hey, I'd ask you just to email me. Um, last time I had something for sale, and I had so many phone calls, and I couldn't return them all. Well, what happens is that when I return a phone call it's not just a five minute conversation it usually turns out you know we're talking about goats and 30 45 minutes go by and uh, one or two of those and and i didn't get in till eight o'clock in the evening anyways and so uh i just can't really do that but i'll i'll respond to you know if anybody sends emails i usually try to respond to all those um so if anybody's interested, uh, you can you can email me. I'll uh, you know I may put this link up on our uh, Facebook page to Grandview Livestock. Um, I'm not able to get real close to them here to give you a good picture of them. Really nice views in there, and there's some nice. Nice goats there too. That, oh, you know, you never know why they don't breed. If there's something wrong with them, they probably bred last year. Some of them goats. Um, anyway, and if nobody's interested in them, we may just turn them back out and keep them for next year. We got some weeds and brush that need eaten. Doesn't really cost us much to keep them. So uh, there they are. I think there's 33 years and and 15 nannies here. There, I don't think there's an really an old one in the bunch. Uh, um, like I said, I think most of them are just young ones that didn't didn't breed the first time or something. And there could be a nanny or two in there that's a middle-aged one. But uh, I don't think there was anybody real old. We put them in another pen. We had some bad bags and a few things like that. We peeled off. I don't know. There's four, five, six of those. So, hey, good to. Uh, talk to y'all again and if anybody's interested you know i've had several calls and emails and such people wanting to know if i had anything for sale and i really didn't at the time um so here some of these make a nice package 33 U's there and, and 15 nannies so hey y'all have a good evening i'm gonna go to the house